What's going on all you mentees? Uncanny Omar here from Nearman Condition and I'm here to announce a brand new Marvel Omnibus coming out in the spring of 2022. So let's go ahead and get started. This video is sponsored by Marvel Comics, so thank you so much to David Gabriel and the fine folks at Marvel for sending us this advanced notification of this upcoming Omnibus in the spring of 2022. Uh, before getting started, hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet, ring that bell for notifications, share the video, let others know where you get your breaking news in the world of the Marvel Collected Edition. So, uh, how do I bring this one up? This is a book that is brand new it hasn't have a, a a volume this is not a volume two of anything it's it is a spin-off series though and i've laid a hint a strong hint out there when people were like omar do you have any hints about any upcoming books and i said yeah okay well this might be one of the biggest hints i could throw out there and i said it's something new so it's clobbering time baby that's right i'm talking about the thing omnibus I did say something new, right? Coming in the spring of 2022. See, I wasn't lying. Let's look at the standard edition cover. So the standard edition cover here is drawn by John Byrne, who was the writer on the series, who, who uh, spun the series off out of his Fantastic Four when he was writing Fantastic Four. So let's look at the content because I'm very excited about this for uh, one huge reason. So. Content, Collecting Thing 1 through 36. Again, this is the series that spun out of FF, and I'll come back to that here in a second. Fantastic Four 274, 277, 296, Secret Wars 2 number 7, West Coast Avengers number 10, Quest Probe number 3, Marvel Tales 198, Marvel Graphic Novel Hulk and Thing, The Big Change, and then material for Marvel Fanfare 15 and Marvel Super Heroes number 5. So, uh, for me, the big thing... <laughs> I didn't even mean that. I swear, I'm telling so many dad jokes. Uh, the big thing about this particular book is that it wraps up the thing. It, originally, it came out, of course, in single issues, but then in collected editions, we had, I believe, two classics, and they never wrapped up the series. I think it took us all the way to issue 21, 22. But this covers everything. And before I go any further about the creators and what kind of things to see in here let's take a look at the direct market cover so this direct market cover is drawn by ron wilson who was one of the big pencilers in the book as a matter of fact he drew a lot of the book 90 percent of this particular omnibus is probably drawn by him uh but you also have some john byrne artwork in here paul neary barry winter smith bernie wrightson yes uh and then of course you have john byrne writing i think the first oh my goodness 17 or so issues uh and then you had mike carlin take over jim shooter has some of the stuff in here steve engelhard david michelini jim starlin uh and bob harris but um one of the coolest things about this run is that if you have the fantastic four omnibus by john byrne volume one and i think that's been reprinted once we need a reprint of volume two but if you have those, this is such a great tie-in to that because John Byrne was trying to make this connect so much with his book. So if something was happening in the pages of Fantastic Four, it affected the pages of the thing. So that was really cool that he was writing both. And he was writing and drawing Fantastic Four. That's why he only does most of the covers here and a couple of pages here and there. But this era is a lot of fun. There's something that happens here because of Secret Wars. Um, and you may know a little bit about that, why there is a certain character in the Fantastic Four. But anyway, Ben goes on his own adventure. It becomes this Space Ranger type of story that goes on for a little while. And there's monsters in here. There's all kinds of twists and turns. And, and then John Byrne does something towards the end of his particular story that makes you question what what was really happening anyway I'm not gonna give anything else away i just wanted to talk about this phenomenal run and so glad that it's coming all together in one big collection like this so yeah now if you have you know be good to maybe get that uh ff uh by john Byrne volume 2 reprinted but anyway uh let me know in the comments down below what you think about this particular book coming in the spring of 2022 don't forget to pre-order and hit that like button subscribe don't forget to ring that bell for notification. All of that does help with our YouTube algorithm and our channel keep growing. And thank you again to David Gabriel and the folks at Marvel for sending us this notice of this particular omnibus. So, everybody, please stay healthy, stay safe, much love.